The meibomian glands produce the lipid layer of the tear film in the eye. The lipid layer protects the eye's natural moisture, or aqueous, and allows the eyelid to glide safely over the eye. Cells on the inner wall of the meibomian gland asini produce oil. In a normal eye, when you blink, the lids touch and pressure is applied to meibomian glands, causing them to express small amounts of this oil. The upper lid then pulls the oil upward over the eye as the lid opens. When the gland becomes blocked, there is not enough oil to coat the tear film, and the aqueous evaporates rapidly. Without adequate lubrication between them, the eyelids and cornea can abrade each other, causing inflammation and cell damage to the lid wiper and cornea. Simply removing meibomian gland blockage isn't enough. The asini may not start producing oil again until the accumulation of dead cells within them are flushed. Doctors now have the ability to assess meibomian gland dysfunction with a meibomian gland evaluator, or MGE. The MGE exerts pressure consistent with a deliberate blink, allowing evaluation of gland secretions in three regions of the eyelid. Using the MGE, secretions for five glands in each region are scored on a scale of 0 to 3. 0, no secretions. 1, inspissated secretions. 2, cloudy secretions or 3, the normal state of clear secretions. The lipoflow system uses heat and a 12-minute pressure profile to remove blockages in the meibomian glands. By heating the glands from the inside, blockages are liquefied. Gentle pressure is applied from outside the lid from the base of the gland to the gland opening, removing blockage and flushing dead cells from the gland. The lipoflow activator insulates on its inner surface and vaults the cornea to protect it from heat. Therapeutic heat of 42.5 degrees is accurately controlled and directed outward, away from the cornea, to the lids. The device never lets the cornea exceed a safe 39.5 degrees, unlike chemical heat packs that have been shown to overheat, also unlike manual lid massage. Lipoflow safely applies pressure to the lids, not to the cornea or the globe.